Hey, what's going on guys? This is Jen. We're going to be doing The House That Built Me by Miranda Lambert. And this was requested by Emily and Stella. And uh, we got, got some requests for a nice, easy arrangement. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to break it down. The guitar part is actually quite complicated. Lots and lots of picking. So what I did is I broke it down into just chords. If you want the actual guitar part, let me know and then we'll do a video that, that has the more complicated, accurate part. But this is just for if you just want to strum and, and sing along, not what's on the recording. Does that make sense? Okay, let's do this. Easy arrangement, the house that built me, Emily and Stella, this is for you. We're gonna start with an F. This is right in on the verse. You can do this little F if you want to, but I encourage doing the bar chords. Where it's two bars of F. So what you can do to make it kind of sound like the recording is arpeggiate these top strings. When I say top, I mean like top as in high strings. And when I say high strings, I mean high in pitch and in sound. So you do F. Now we're going to go to A minor. Now we're going to go to B flat. You can do B flat like this, back to F, quick change to C, and then you repeat that. So you repeat that twice, so two times for the verse, F, A minor, B flat, F, and C. Now we go into the pre-chorus. Well, it's, it's more like, ah, it's like the chorus pre-chorus kind of thing. So we got B flat, again, you can do this if you want to, to F to G minor, back to F, B flat, D minor, B flat, F, this is like the chorus, B flat, won't take nothing but a memory, F, from the house, that C, Now we go it back into the verse and then the pre-chorus chorus. Now we do the bridge. Well, all that's the same, so we're going to do the bridge now, which is D minor, F, no new chords, G, B flat, and then C. And stay on C. Now if you want to strum that, Strokes, eight notes, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So lots of different options for you. Now the only other thing is at the very, very end, um, when she's singing that last chorus, the outro, it changes just slightly. So you say, if I could, I swear I'd leave. B flat, that's the same. Won't take nothing but a memory. F from the house, C, the build. Now go back to B flat, which is beautiful. Nice little outro. F, two, three, four. Now quick change, G minor, C, resolve to F. So not so bad. I know these chords can be a little bit of a beast, which again, that's why I wanted to, to simplify it and not make it so hard that you can't play it, that, an, that a beginner and intermediate can't play it. But if you really want the original guitar part, send us a little request. Post it, post it on the on 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 the on the YouTube on the YouTube. <laughs> that's right, I said on the YouTube, and uh, and let us know if you want that, and that's totally fine. But I kind of wanted to open it up for everybody to be able to play. So get these bar chords happening. You're going to see them everywhere. I know you love this song, so this is going to be a great challenge. I think that there are rats in the walls that are scratching, and it's kind of freaking me out, but it's okay. Everything's okay. We're okay here at Mahalo. That's it. Find us on Facebook. <laughs> I swear to God, there's something. 
Maybe it's like Freddy Krueger. I don't know. I'm scared. Um, find us on Facebook. Send us requests. Rate. Subscribe. Like. You know how we do. All right. Thanks, guys. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. To learn more songs, check out these videos. To learn more guitar, go to mahalo.com slash play guitar. Thank you.